video today and as you can see under my favorite face which is the bathroom and today I will be as you can see by the title this this conversation is about Kanye West and first of all this is not no celebrity gossip channel this ain't none of that but if something needs to be talked about and brought to my attention I think I want to make a video talking about it and it's just toxic behavior that we embrace the toxic culture and if y'all don't know what's going on, I mean, it's every, pretty much everywhere you look. You know what I'm saying? Like, Kanye West and Kim Kardashian, they're going through, like, a divorce or whatever. And he just been spazzing out. I'm talking about acting real obsessed, real insecure, real if I can't have you, nobody else can have you, real. Yeah, that type of energy. And, it, and, and you know what I'm saying? The topic of this video, the main focus of this video is, like I said, embracing toxic culture. And... People, instead of people like, like he's been doing some real off the wall stuff. All you gotta do is Google it. I'm pretty sure y'all probably seen it on our timeline. It's literally like everywhere. He just been spazzing out just doing some crazy stuff. And that just reminds me, and, the, and the, the, what came to my attention is the comments. Most of the comments are laughing emojis. Most of the comments are, yes, fight for your wife. Get your family back. And I'm just like, the stuff that he's doing is very toxic. The stuff that he's doing is very dangerous. The way he's acting, it don't seem like he's in a good mental space to be doing the stuff that he's doing. And okay, that's him. But I'm talking about y'all. The people who are embracing this, who tell him he need to get his family back. He doing the right thing trying to get his wife back. Like, why are we so caught up with embracing toxic culture and oh my, and toxic Every like when it comes to relationships, like I don't know what y'all been taught, what y'all think, but relationships are not supposed to be toxic and all of this. <laughs> see, that be y'all problem. Y'all think when a man acting like that that he love you. Oh my god, it's so cute. He's crazy about me. Oh my goodness, I love that. I want a man to be crazy about me like that. Like, no, that's not healthy. That is not healthy. When the person say they want to leave and they want to end something. Both parties should be respected and respect that decision. A person should not be stalked, harassed, bugged, and all this type of stuff. And we view it as love. And I'm like, no. Because let's be honest. If that was Michael up the street talking to Tanya like that, or acting like that, if Tanya, want, the Tanya up the street left Michael, and she was your cousin or your sister, and um, Michael was acting like Kanye, y'all would be, oh, he crazy. You need to get a restraining order. You need to, um, uh-uh, we need to um watch out for him because he crazy. He acting out. All that type of stuff. But, because it's a celebrity and the person is famous, or because y'all got toxic mindset, y'all are quick to say fight for your family, fight for your girl, fight for your wife. And it's like, no. When a person says they don't want to be with you no more and a relationship is about to end and needs to end, respect it. If y'all can't agree together to come together and be respectable and try to work it out because both parties want that, be respectable because that's dangerous. That's giving me very much OJ Simpson vibes is all I'm saying with what he's doing and how he's acting. And I'm just disgusted by y'all agreeing with this. I'm like, what type of world are we living in? We we got to stop embracing toxic culture. Toxic love. Do y'all not see all, the domestic, all these domestic violence cases going on? Men and women. Women are crazy and men are crazy. And women are killing men because they don't want to lead the relationship in. And men are killing women. Like... When are y'all gonna learn stuff's not cute? We have to learn. And to get even deeper into it, like y'all think it's cute. I'm not talking about playing with this part right here. I'm just talking about just toxic love. Let's get into the physical. Like let men put their hands on you. Let men control you. Let men do this. Or let women, let women control you. Let women use you. You know what I'm saying? Abuse you and all that type of stuff. No. And stalk you. What? No. If a person showing you them signs, 
That is not love. That is toxic. And we got to stop embracing toxic culture, toxic love, toxic relationships. And just learn to be okay with things ending. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's just mind-blowing to me. I'm like, bro, if that was your sister, you know darn well y'all would be like, oh, oh, crazy, going crazy. But because it's Kanye West and because y'all so used to toxic love, it's okay. He's fighting for his relationship. But yeah, like I said, this ain't no um celebrity gossip channel. I just like to talk about important things that I think is an issue. And I think toxic culture and toxic love is an issue. And dang, I ain't even say welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you do. <laughs> and never been here before. Thank you for coming back. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to rant about that. This channel, I just do random rants about important things that's on my mind that I think other people should hear. So for the younger people, it, well, not even younger people, anybody going through something, don't embrace toxic love, okay? It's all about positivity and being at peace with things, okay? So, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to thumbs up. If you enjoyed it, thumbs down. Let me know y'all thoughts. Do y'all think this is fighting for your wife? Do y'all think it's okay to stalk someone that doesn't want to be with you anymore? So, let me know in the comments. Okay. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Bye-bye.